Mac, New York City, Washington Heights. I promote music and I teach fifth grade. Um, I promote any sort of music that I think is positive music. I do drum and bass, I do hip hop, I do um, progressive house music, not progressive English house music, deep house music, Detroit techno, not boom, boom, boom techno, Detroit techno, Paul Craig, Derek May. I've done um, five band shows. Kind of looking for work to the future is Apollo Heights. I've been doing this for about 30 years. I've been doing Hunting Jungle for about 12 years. And right now I'm looking at doing a series of uh, hip hop drum based collaborations with the proper venue to do it. And I'm um, talking to some West Coast people, I'm talking to some people with the execution of the Rock Raider. In the UK, it's much more of a popular music. Here it's pop music, and it's never really grown outside of that. I think about six years ago, drum and bass was more popular in America. And there was a point where it got too much into rock music, it got too dark and too heavy. And it drove away a lot of people who were like more soulful, more rock and hard. It's a struggle, it's an uphill struggle. There was a point when we were really through the in thing, everyone was through the trendy thing, everyone was into it. That was around 98. And then it went to a downslide, and now people doing it are really in it for the love of it. And it's an uphill struggle to get people to be conscious of the music and the diversity that's uh, available. Well, I think jungles. Strength has been that the people who are into it have been stayed really loyal to it. But um, a weakness of Jungle has been that there are more DJs than there are fans. The people who are into it are so into it that they become DJs and that we've sort of spread ourselves out really thin. And so that we really need to work on taking Jungle to the next level. I think one of the things that Jungle has never done, drum and bass has never done seriously, is to work with MCs. There's always been sort of like Karras did a thing with Goldie, but it was like one person here, one person there. And there needs to be more serious collaborations with MCs who are aware of the drum and bass, with DJs who are aware of the MCs. Not simply, I play my music, you rap over it, or I'm going to rap, and play music behind me. There needs to be more serious collaboration.